Hello, grace and peace unto you, my brothers and sisters in the Gnosis. It's Father Tony. I'm here at the Joanite Conclave for 2014. I'm pretty excited. This is the uh, lovely room that they have me in. Ooh, how nice. It's like a hotel room, only it's a monastery. <laughs> I'm not supposed to be talking very loud in here, so I'm trying to keep this kind of quiet. I want to record a bunch of these while I'm here if possible. Uh, but uh, So this is going to be the first one. I just wanted to uh, kind of let you know what uh, what we're doing here and, and what the Conclave is all about and, and why this is kind of exciting, kind of a big deal. The Conclave is our annual gathering and uh, we have uh, speakers and lectures and workshops and all kinds of stuff. Today I did a workshop that I do pretty much every year on the uh, liturgical uh, rubrics in our church. Uh, basically I, I teach the, uh, the seminarians how to actually perform the Mass, which is kind of fun. I enjoy doing that because, you know, I kind of well, I enjoy it because I have a theater background and having all the stuff kind of laid out and that you do this at this time in this order and for this reason, it's, it's, it's nice. I, I enjoy that part of, of what I do as a priest. I met our featured speaker, Dr. Zlatko Plazy, I want to say is how you pronounce his name. Uh, and he's going to be talking about uh, the Gospel of John, I think, and some other stuff. When I met Dr. Plazy, I was carrying a book uh, that is... Um, scholarly him being a you know a professor of uh, biblical studies and whatever he does so I was carrying this book with me Elaine Pagels that I haven't read a whole bunch of I'm probably a little under halfway through and uh, very good so far the Joanite uh, the Joanine gospel in Gnostic exegesis it's just a short little monograph uh, so uh, I do recommend uh, that you pick up that book if you're at all interested in the, the stream of the community of John. Uh, she definitely gives an interesting view of how the Valentinians specifically would have used the Gospel of John in their own teachings and practices. So definitely worth worth looking at. I actually, I have no idea what the schedule is. I pretty much just walk down there and, and show up in the room and then people tell me what's happening, uh, which is convenient and inconvenient because I actually have a lot of presentations that I'm doing this year, um, which I've absolutely more or less prepared for, so uh, th that, that'll be good. But, you know, I wing it. I'm very good on my feet. Um, at least nobody's noticed <laughs> so far. So, uh, yeah, and we had an interesting discussion also about social media and the use of social media in the church and, and how we can... How we, can, how we use it, how we should be using it, how we shouldn't be using it, you know, our personal pages versus our parish pages and, and things like that. And so it's a lot of interesting things to talk about. And of course, in my secular job for the Boy Scouts, I also do a lot of social media. So I have, um, I have some stuff to say about that. And, and, uh, and it's, it's interesting. It's, it's hard work, but uh, at the same time, I think, I think it's, it's, worth, uh, it's worth doing. It's worth doing right because... That's the only way that people find out about us. Uh, let's see, what else do we do today? Monsignor Rosbach gave a presentation on the Joanite Rosary, which is a practice I've been doing quite a bit of lately. Um, it's, uh, it's very nice. He actually added a whole second section. So there's now twice as much Joanite Rosary stuff than there was when I wrote my book originally and put the first part in my book. So uh, it, look forward to that. I will definitely post that uh, in the various places on my website and, and, and some stuff uh, so that you can find that when it comes out and, uh, and start doing that practice or at least the second part of that practice on your own. I'll try and get some guest vlogs in here too, try and record some people. Uh, and, with the, that might have some things to say. So uh, so stay tuned. I'm going to cut this one off. We're going to do a short one today. And then I'm going to record some more later. And uh, hopefully I'll get a bunch of stuff to uh, put out for you over the course of this week. So I'll see you next time.